I'm starting off this DIY video with Dollar Tree clear rulers. I'll be covering up the numbers with tape. And happy Thanksgiving to you all! Now this DIY is something that I know you guys would love for Christmas. During the holidays, we have lights everywhere. So this is an additional lighting that will brighten up your space even more with style. After I started with this size, I realized that it was too wide. And so I changed it. I had another idea in my head on how to remove the numbers. And my first attempt was to use 100% acetone. That is a nail polish remover and it did not work at all. So I decided that the easiest way to go about this design and still have it functional is to cover up the numbers and I'm still going to have the transparent side that's in the middle that's going to reflect the lighting. And yes, I am making a DIY lighting that's going to be multifunctional as a wall sconce, a vase and a table lamp. I'll be using 15 rulers from the Dollar Tree for this project. I took my time to cover up all of the numbers on just one side of the rulers alone. I left the other side because to me, I just feel like once in a while, it would be nice to remind myself of what I used in making the item. If you're new to my channel, it's so great to have you here. Now, don't forget to click on the subscribe button and that notification bell so you don't miss out on any of my latest videos. When I was done covering the numbers on this side of the rulers, I flipped it over and then used a clear tape to hold them together. I'm using a clear tape so that I can see the light through the openings. And also the tape is going to hold all the rulers together in such a way that it will be easy to roll them into a round shape. This is what I wanted from the very beginning to have it flexible like this to be able to roll. And I'll be rolling this around a Dollar Tree mirror. I'll be pre-drilling holes around the rulers to make it easy for me to attach them to the plastic that's around the mirror. I'm going to use silver tape to cover up the sides of the mirror first before attaching the rulers to it. I ended up using just four screws to hold the rulers to the plastic because I'm going to need the other holes for another design later on in this video. I 
I folded and closed the top with hot glue. I'm going to be covering up the nail heads with gems. If you would like to recreate this for your home, you can go ahead and cover up the numbers on the inside. But like I said earlier, I left the numbers to remind myself what I used in making this item. This is what it looks like as a vase. And it's super pretty. And you can use this by the side of the chair or even on a table. This can also be used as a table lamp. You just have a remote control push lights inside to make it easy to turn the lights on and off. And now you have a mobile extra lighting. Another idea on how to use this lighting is to have it on the wall, mounted as a wall sconce. Now, the easiest way to go about this is to attach it to a wooden plaque. I got this from the Dollar Tree spray painted it silver, covered up the sides with mirror mosaic tiles, and the list for all the items that I used in this DIY project is gonna be down in the description box below. After I had that done, I then attached corner braces to it. Now this corner brace is gonna also hold wood that's gonna connect this plaque to what I just made earlier with the rulers. And guys, you should also know that what I made with the rulers can also be used for a pendant lighting, but that will be for another video. I covered up the oval plaque with mirrors. To keep this balanced, I attached what I made with the rulers to the wood on two sides. I'll be using a remote control push lights inside for lighting. You can use a hook like this to mount it on the wall or command strips. I personally prefer the command strips because it keeps it flat on the wall. This looks so pretty on the wall and you can still see the numbers on the rulers. But like I said earlier, it would be nice for me to remember what I used in making this item. But then you can totally cover them up with tape if you don't want to see the numbers. This lighting can also be mounted upside down. Isn't it nice to know the regular rulers from the Dollar Tree can give you decorative and functional pieces that you can use in your home. And to all my YouTube fam, happy Thanksgiving! Now don't forget to save me a turkey! <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching. I have other home decor DIY videos that are linked in the description box below to check them out. And for those of you who have not subscribed to my channel, don't forget to click on the subscribe button. 